Hey guys, it's Phil here from Aussie Garage and Raw Talk TV. Look, check out the, all these beautiful rides down here. I mean, that orange thing is stunning down there, that 34. And then the Sandman, Dirty Q over there. I think we've seen that in Motivation last year, which was amazing. Um, and some of these other cars, like even that XC down there, that hard top coupe is just lovely. Um, that Simon Birch's car over there, that little mighty boy, that thing is just off the chain. Some very, very lovely cars in here. They're sensational, they're all stunning.
Guys, you can sh should check out this um, XY Overlander that's here. It's a station wagon. Thing's done in red. It's got a faker shaker on it. Um, it's been sitting out here now on display. It looks sensational. A bit like the old Holden Overlanders. And the old Overlanders come out in station wagons, utes, panel vans. And I think that's about it, really. So did the Ford one. So, hey, it's a lovely little thing. Once it's done up, it's going to look sensation. And the guy only bought it for 30 odd thousand, now he's doing it up. So it's perfect. How about that? Hey man, you should come and check out this bloody 57 like limo that I've got here. All in red. Nice. This thing is long as. Oh look, it's all decked out inside. Like perfect. I reckon they must be using these for events all over the school. Bloody year 12 bowls and shit and everything like that. Yeah. <laughs> but this thing is unreal. Oh wow. Yep. This is nice. A lot of work would have had to go into this to stretch this out, as it is. That is definitely something different. What's a Roadrunner? A Plymouth Roadrunner, awesome. Look at that. That's definitely nice. Like you don't see many of those running around Australia, that's for sure. 383 in it. Whew, nice red paint job. No. No, I'm, I'm yeah. That thing's got some nice fat meat underneath too. It's definitely still a nice 57. Old tea bucket. Wow. Look at this thing. This thing's things for sale too, man. A bit of flathead V8 in it, the whole lot. Like, nice. Some big old white walls. You gotta love the old white wall tires on these things. It just makes these cars, that's for sure. Hey guys, check out this 53 Chev. Like, paintwork on this is sensational. Love how the orange just pops in the sun here. All the chrome work on it, a beautiful V8 in it. Small block Chev by the looks of it. Interior is sensational. What's it got? Orange and bloody white interior, which is perfect. This thing is a sweet ride. Love it. You definitely get some attention rolling down the road in this thing, especially with the paintwork standing out bloody with the metallic on it. And then next to it, you got the same thing, but in red, just a different model. But motor's got a supercharger in it. And that's a six with a supercharger. Wow. 1961, bloody, oh, it's a, it's a Holden. Ah, look at that, nice.
Yeah, this thing's beautiful. Love it, love the colour. How you going guys, it's Phil from Aussie Garage here with Raw Talk TV. Now, Lindsay, tell us about your ride, mate. She's a 1934 Ford yep. uh, Roadster. Excellent. Uh, build time was seven years. What made you buy that car in the first place? My neighbour who, um, you know, we're really good mates. So, and he said to me, hey, we've got to do something to keep us home. Yep. He, he, he came over to my house one day and he went, I found something for you and showed me a picture of it. Um, it was actually a magazine of, of, of hot rods. Yeah, yep. And I went, that one. Yep. And that's what it was. And then, nice. Yeah, we found this rolling chassis in Port Augusta. Okay, yep. Pointing into a, into a workshop, and as we pulled up the front of the workshop, all I seen was these two 450 tires. wide tires. And yeah. I went, that's it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. definitely. Yeah, yeah. And yeah. it looks better with the guards, I think. I, yeah. I, I don't like the little bicycle type. Oh, guards. okay, yeah, yeah, you know, fair I enough. The, it gives better sleek yep. lines. Yep, yep. Nicer lines. Absolutely, <laughs> no, I love that. Mm. I mean, did it have suicide doors when you first got it, or did you yes. put those in? No, okay, no, no, perfect. No. Uh, yeah. Like I said, as we bought it as a rolling chassis, yep. um, it came just with the tub, the okay. suicide doors, and because the, the rear wheels are tubbed so far in, into the boot, we yep. couldn't have a dicky seat, so it is a boot. Yep. I well, wanted the dicky seat so we could take the dogs for a drive, but oh, okay. we can't yeah, have yeah. that, so. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> depends on how big your dogs are, so. Uh, yeah. Little. Okay, yeah, yeah. yeah. You might be able to still shove them in there, but I don't know if they'll be not comfortable. When the, not when the door, when <laughs> yeah. the boot's closed. No, they wouldn't like No, no, that that's much. fair enough. <laughs> um, uh, she's got a 351 Windsor. Oh, nice. Little 671 supercharger. Oh, perfect, yeah. Uh, yeah. Twin 650 um, quick fuel sitting on top. Oh, wow. Um, behind that is a, is a um, B&M AOD. Yep. So automatic with overdrive. Uh, differential is a winter's quick change. Okay, so yep. It's a, so it's a race diff. Yep. Um, Push button auto. Nice. Yeah. Top the wheels are uh, Boyd Coddington's. Okay. Yep. Junkyard dogs. So the rears are a 450 wide. Okay. So yeah. um, colours are candy brandy wine. It's nice colour. Uh, over a silver base. Yep. Almost everything on it is either hand built. Yep. Or bought and altered. Okay. We've, we've had her on the road for just over three years. Done just over 7,000 kilometres in them. Oh, perfect. Yep. So, yep. so she's a driver. Yep. 
Well, look, thanks for talking to us here My at Aussie pleasure. Garage and, and Raw Talk TV. And yeah. uh, look, at the end of the day, hopefully we'll see you around a bit more. Yeah. You never know your luck in a big city. Awesome. Thanks, right. mate. So if you want to get your event t-shirt, get up and see uh, Colleen and Chell up there and uh, grab yourself an event t-shirt. But once again, get it quickly because all the popular sizes are going fast. This dirty queue is off the chain, man. The colour in this just pops, especially with the white pinstriping on it, all the stripes on it. It's just a beautiful colour. Like I said, this thing was our motivation, and this thing was sick. Loved it. They did it really well. Oh, these are awesome, eh? <laughs> Fucking hell.
Yeah, those are awesome, eh? <laughs> Fucking hell.